The wait is finally over. We got Pietro. What's poppin' YouTube? Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time on this channel and you enjoy this video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for future content. In today's video, we have an exciting pop to share. This pop, everyone's been waiting since last month. And we've been teased by Funko with a bunch of excuses being released. And we've been waiting for this one and it finally dropped today by surprise. So let's go ahead and get this one started. Right now, we just parked. We are walking to Funko Hollywood and the line is not too bad compared to usual so we're gonna go ahead and join the line right now pietro finally released pretty nice day out right now here's our spot in line ticket to prevent cutting all right here we go we're going in and we're about to grab the pietro honestly i always love walking into funko hollywood i love all the props they have everywhere i just love it how you doing, guys? Hello, hello. How are you, buddy? Right this way, guys. Okay? Just okay. use the tape on the floor. Sounds good. Thank you. All right, let's keep walking and get that Pietro. Uh... Hello. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Would you I... any Moonlight Smash or Dark Side? Just Pietro. Pietro? Okay, she'll grab it. Thank you. Grab your Pietro today? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Have a great day. Over here we have George. Oh my god. Look at that hair. Man. You're gonna be helping me check out YouTube? my Pietro today. Oh my god. He also collects WandaVision. I love WandaVision. Yes, he does. His hair is WandaVision inspired. They are still doing Pop Yourself. If you guys are local and you haven't done it yet, I'd recommend it. It's actually really fun. So now that we're out, let's go ahead and check out what the line looks like now. So far, it's looking like it's still pretty long. This line is actually pretty insane. I wonder where it ends. So this is where the line ends actually. It's pretty crazy. So that's right, after a whole month of waiting, we finally got Pietro. I'm super excited to share with you guys out of the box. But before we do, let's go ahead and talk about this pop real quick. So this pop was supposed to release in March initially. That was the month that Funko said it would be releasing. However, instead we got a whole bunch of other exclusives. And then once we got to the final week of March, we were all like, finally, Pietro should be releasing because it's March. He did not release. Then we got into April and a lot of people were just upset because Pietro still didn't release. And constantly they just kept asking Funko, where's Pietro? When is he coming out? That's not Pietro. I figured it was probably just an issue with their shipment and they were waiting on their stock to arrive. And that day was today. I did not get lucky online. I kept getting this error. So if you guys got lucky online, congrats to you guys. But if you guys missed out like myself, go ahead and click that notify me button that shows right under Pietro right now on their site. And then put in your email, they will be emailing you once it's back in stock. I went to Hollywood today because I did not want to miss out on this pop. I know it's really popular and I definitely wanted it for my collection. So let's go ahead and check it out. I actually love that they had it in the sorter because that means it's less likely to have any damage. But let's go ahead and take him out. There it is. Pietro Maximoff from WandaVision. Now we all know it's not really him. That's why they added these quotations around the name. But what a great looking pop. And then on the backside, we have the next wave of the WandaVision pops. We have Agatha, Monica, Scarlet Witch, and Vision. I will be getting those in soon. I did not get the Vision because I want the glow-in-the-dark Walmart version instead, but what a great looking pop. I'm so excited to finally have it in the collection. So it's definitely exciting to finally add the Ralph Boner, Pietro Maximoff Funko Pop from WandaVision, and he looks incredible with the rest of the Halloween WandaVision Funko Pop. So we have Wanda, Vision, Billy, and Tommy, now we finally got Pietro and they just look really great all together. I also almost forgot to share these two brand new Funko Pops that are exclusive to Hot Topic. Really great looking pieces. We got the Flock Clifford, the Big Red Dog, as well as the Diamond Collection Selena. I'm so excited to add these to the collection. Now I'm just waiting on Hot Topic to release the Flock Eduardo from Foster's Home of Imaginary Friends. I know it was available for pre-sale, but I missed out on it. It's not available in stores yet. But these two over here, I just got them in stores and they are absolutely amazing. If you're not new to this channel, you know exactly what time it is now. It is time to get these pops out of the box for a closer look. So let's go ahead and get to the magic in three, two, one. And they're out. Check out the pops we have today. Really awesome looking figures. We have the Flock Clifford. We also have Pietro from WandaVision. Then we have Diamond exclusive from Hot Topic of Selena. I actually think this one looks nicer than the Funko Shop exclusive personally, although I do love both, but these are amazing. Let's get some 360 spins. Starting it off, here we have the Flock Clifford. Honestly, this is a really well done pop. I really like the red look of the Flock. It looks really nice. 
But this pop is just honestly super adorable. Really, really cute. I love it. Coming up next, we have the Diamond Collection Selena in her burgundy outfit. Now, this one I think came out really nice. Like I said earlier, I do prefer this one over the Funko Shop exclusive. Personally, I just think this one looks a lot nicer. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. But I think this pop came out fantastic. And then finally, here we have Pietro from WandaVision. Rolf Boner looking amazing. I absolutely love this pop. I think Funko nailed it. I love all the little extra details. And the mold just looks absolutely fantastic. Check out those details from the speed. That looks incredible. Let's zoom in real quick. Check out that base. I absolutely love that. It reminds me of the Emerald City Comic Con Ogre. But this looks super great. And then he's also holding the spray cans with the hairspray that he used for Tommy's hair. This was actually one of my favorite episodes as well. So I'm super excited to add this one to the collection. So that's all I had for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comments below what do you guys think of the Pietro Pop I shared in today's video. Also, let me know if you guys were able to get it or not. Maybe online, Funko Hollywood like myself, or even at Funko HQ. But if you guys missed out, don't worry. It's going to be restocking. Go ahead and hit that notify me button on Funko site. They will send you an email once it's back in stock. And I just want to say thank you all so much for taking time out of day to watch this video. And if you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and it's free. But let me know what you guys like to see in the next videos. Thank you all for watching and peace.